Hey guys, I'm about to head off on a three week tour with an Irish group called the Celts. Uh, we're, we're playing a Christmas tour, Christmas with the Celts. Um, so I'm going to be gone for a while, I won't be able to post any videos. I'm hoping to be able to do some session videos. We've got a fantastic Ellen Piper who's coming on the road with us, so hopefully we'll be able to have a few tunes and maybe get those recorded just for fun. Uh, but in the meantime, I'm going to play one of the songs we're doing with the tour. It's coming up on Christmas, so I thought it might be time to do uh, my favorite Christmas carol, which I get to play with the group, and it's Oh Holy Night. So hopefully you know the song, you know the melody anyway, but I'm going to run through that real quick, just the basic melody, and come back and get the ornaments and all that stuff. So, here we go. <laughs> first part. Um, that actually gets used in the second section as well, but we'll finish up the first section here. The second section uses that same bit. finish off the sections where it gets a little bit tricky. It's probably the hardest part of the whole song, uh, and that's because you got a G sharp where you have to half hold it, which in, its, in and of itself isn't terrible, but you're going from a G sharp down to an F sharp, which means you got to play it and then quickly jump to that next note, but I'll, I'll run that through real quickly here. I'll do that again just so you can see what I'm doing. That's kind of the whole first uh, first phrase of the song, anyway. <laughs> Second one starts on the A. So that's the phrase there, and that kind of repeats as well. We do that the second again. Now, to the, the exciting dramatic bit jumps up. And the really dramatic part jumps up to that F sharp. Now in this part we've got an octave jump, which hopefully you watch the video on that uh, because that's going to be pretty important. Otherwise you're going to squeak the notes. But I'll play the whole uh, the final section there, yeah, with the with the octave jump and everything. I'll do that again. Uh, again, make sure you practice those octave jumps because it's. If that's not right, kind of ruins the whole thing. So there's the whole melody. I'm going to play it again like I do with the group, uh, with the ornaments and all that kind of stuff. <laughs> so hopefully it's a fun one you like to play the, play this tune. It might come up at a you know, school concert or a choir, church, things like that. So. If you have any need for it, hopefully this, uh, this video is of some use. So here's how I play it.
I hope you like that song. It's uh, one of my favorite Christmas carols, really my favorite Christmas carol of all time. Uh, just a beautiful tune. Um, as far as the ornaments, things like that, um, one of the things that I like to do on this one, which I don't think I've ever actually done a video on, uh, it's an ornament on the C sharp. Um, there's not a whole lot you can do with that note because you don't have anything above it to, to do a proper uh, a roll on. So you can do a tap like that. Um, but in this case, what I, what I like to do is, I guess it'd be kind of the second part. Uh, on that part, um, you can do And you're just kind of using your top hand to, to kind of force a roll as these two fingers kind of grow over that hole. Like that. Kind of a cool little thing, cool little trick that I like to do. So, hope you like that song. Um, hope you're having a great holiday in case I don't uh, post any other videos. Until then, if you've got any questions, feel free to let me know. Any requests, I'm happy to get after them. Uh, probably might not be until I get back, though. So, uh, Merry Christmas, everybody, and I will talk to you all later. Thanks very much.